At school, I saw the kid wearing these white shoes, but he had drawn all over them, and they looked super cool. So I was like, why can't I make some of those? So I told my parents about them, and they got these for me for Easter, and I was going to draw on them, and I was like, why don't I just make this a video? It can be kind of like a uh, 100 sub video, even though I'm already doing a Q&A, this is just like a side project. So, um, I got these, these were $18, I'll put the link in the description, and I just bought these Sharpie markers, I got my pencil, and I drew out a few um, practice sketches um, that I'm going to sketch on these shoes. So, first off, I think I'm going to draw with the pencil, I'm going to outline it in pen, and then I'm going to go over with the Sharpies, um, because there's all these different areas. I think I'm going to really design it, make it really cool. Some of it will be time-lapse, some of it won't. So I'm just going to get into this. Hopefully this turns out good. This is kind of my first time doing this. This is new for me. And I'm kind of really hoping this turns out cool. Okay, so this video is definitely going to be a long one. Right now, I'm thinking it's going to be at like 25 minutes. And I was recording this over like the span of like, what? I think a week it actually took me to make these. But I'm super proud of them. In the thumbnail, I didn't show them just because I want the end to be a surprise. Um, so I know I have had people tell me, like, just, like, the sound of my voice is, like, I have good stories and I'm good. I, I don't know. People have told me that, like, they'll, like, binge my videos and I can keep, like, a good story and stuff. Um, so if you like to hear me talk a lot about random things, then yay, this is the video for you because this is going to be, like, 25 minutes of me talking um, about also the shoes and some other stuff. Right now, I'm just doing the outline and pen. Um, so a lot of the parts I'm going to have to skip over just because this video would be like hours long. And some of the parts I didn't record, some of the like really hard detail parts. Because um, I make these videos alone. I, I'm kind of like solo on this. Sometimes I'll ask a friend to do some audio for me. But that's kind of it. I edit these. I animate. Well, not really animate. I do all this on my own. So I also have to film on my own. And it's hard to record while you're, um, while you're coloring shoes. So it's like... So I had to like put the camera on a bunch of books. A lot of times it'll fall over. So you guys may notice that. There's a few times the camera will fall over. Um... One of the things I went for with the these shoes is um, I tried to, like, have parts of my personality. So, like, as you can see right now, I'm working on my dog. So, that's a picture of my dog, Jackson. He's 15. He just turned 15 in May. I got a camera because I love to film and record. Um, and then hockey sticks because I play hockey. Most of the uh, long-time Action Diddler fans would probably know that um, because one of my really popular videos was a hockey video. Um, also a really cringy video was my hockey video as well. Um, so yeah, and then I'm going to write, like, right now I'm writing Marvel as well. So I'm just kind of adding parts of my personality to this. Um, the, the problem with these though is like, I, I don't really want to wear them anywhere because like if I wear them around, they're going to get dirty and stuff. But, um, so now I'm going to work on this one. So like I said, I'm going to skip ahead a lot, um, and I'm going to go back and add details on later. So, like, I may draw just a few sketches on one shoe and then go to the next, but then I'll go back once I do, like, outline it. I may go back and then work on the other one again. So I'm just kind of going back and forth between them, just doing what I, I like. So right now I'm drawing pencils because... Pencils, drawing kind of kind of stands for itself um so yeah another thing I'm also really trying to um kind of trying to uh, I'm trying to think what the word would be um uh kind of evolve my art style if that makes sense to you guys I'm trying to make it better make it not so not so much cartoony but not like super realistic just just put more um because I feel like I can sketch drawings way better than I can when I'm drawing them. Just because um, I have to use a free drawing software. Because I don't make monies off, money, monies, monies off my video. I don't make money off of my videos. Um, so it's like I don't have a really expensive um, drawing software. I spent like all my money on this awesome drawing tablet. Which is pretty awesome. Like 
I love it. But the only problem is the editing software I use is slow and crashes. And um, my pen will kind of, it'll like drag the editing software. So that's kind of annoying and it's harder for me to draw. But um, this, with the, um, the tablet, it makes it way, the process is, well, it's slower in some aspects, but the quality is way better. I just made a new video that honestly, it was super short, but it was, I thought the quality was amazing. Um, it was like 40 something seconds and it took like 20 minutes to upload because I, I was able to like upload it in 4k ultra HD, which is awesome. I usually don't upload my videos like that. Um, so I'm going to go back to this drawing just because I know some of you might want me to talk about it. So I have a guitar that I've drawn and then this little, um, so I sketched just randomly. I was bored. So I sketched this little dude, um, wearing pants. It's like an egg wearing pants. So then I drew that. I don't know if you guys saw that, um, on the side. Um, I'll, I'll show you guys that later. Um, if you guys can spot, it. it's like a little egg wearing pants. It's really funny. Um, I also got my Axular Avatar, the pizza, you can kind of see that. Um, right now I'm writing comics, just because I love comics. I should show you guys, um, or actually, I think I might have in my Stan Lee video. I don't think I showed you my whole collection. I may make a little video about that, like, but um, I'll do that later. So, right now, I'm, like I told you, I'm going back to the other shoe. So, I'm kind of switching around between them. So, now I'm going back to this one, adding on more detail. Like I said, this took forever to do, and I'm going to have to skip forward quite a few times. Um, because if I just put all this together, it would be so long. And I had to, like, speed this up and make it fast. Um, and another problem is, is I don't have, like, pro editing software. It's good editing software, like, really good. Better than just, like, some iMovie thing. But it's not, it's not, like, professional movie. So, um... It's, I'm not complaining, it works for me, because I'm just a YouTube channel that doesn't make money, I do this mainly for fun, but, um, when I speed it up really fast, it'll get pretty glitchy, um, so, I have to, uh, it was really hard editing this together, and I, I had trouble cropping out some parts, because I really liked them, but, in the end, I kind of like, I really loved how these sh shoes turned out, and I liked how the video turned out, um, so I just wrote the Avengers A. Um, it's only a sketch because I'm going to have to go back and then across. Um, and so now I'm going in on the sides. First off, I'm going to write my name because, like, that's what you kind of got to do. Like, I feel like that, that was probably the first thing that came into mind when I was thinking about what to put on the shoes, like my name. So I got my name down there. And then because buying these, actually, these are really cheap. I know I said this at the start of the video, but... I didn't like how they had, like, um, these, these, uh, lines. I don't know what you call those. So, like, there were little sections of the shoe. So, I had to, like, go in. There wasn't as much room as I thought there would be. But still, it worked. Um, it just wasn't what I expected. But, I mean, hey, th these are still pretty awesome. Um, so, oh, yeah. And so, right now, I'm drawing a book just because, like, I love books especially comic books. Those are my favorite type of books. So there you go. That's kind of like the outline so far. Um, so there, I think, um, cause I couldn't add all the outlines and some of the things I didn't even show me outlining them. I just fast forwarded like to the part where they were done just because the video was getting so long. And I think I didn't even bother recording it. Cause I was just like, I'm not going to keep this. So yeah, right now I'm drawing a Spider-Man head where I just finished um, because Spider-Man is my favorite superhero. I, I, I forget if I've mentioned this in previous videos. Um, and of course, now I'm, I have to put Rip Stan Lee because, um, uh, these, this shoe, I also kind of want to be able to look back and remember, like, what happened that year because Stan Lee died, um, well, he died in November, so it was 2018. I made this in 2019. Still, I'll be able to look back and be like, because this, I made, this is like a six, my sixth grade year. Um, and I'm going to be going into seventh grade next year. So I can just look back and this was like my sixth grade year. Um, so I'm also going to write the, um, the Flash logo because, um, I love the TV show The Flash. Well, I did. They kind of are ruining him. In my opinion, I have friends that love him, love them now, but like, I just, I don't like the new, the new 
style. But now I'm going to go over it. So one mistake I made is I started going over the YouTube symbol with Sharpie before pin. So the YouTube symbol looks really weird and messed up and I do not like it. So I kind of caught myself. It was like crap. So um, that was the one mistake I made. The YouTube symbol just really pops out in a way that I don't like. And it really makes me cringe seeing it. So, yeah, the rest of it I had to go back in on pin. Uh, and the pin worked out really good, and then I had to go back over it with Sharpie because just... Oh, sorry, that was a mic fall. Um, like I said, I record this all on my own, sitting at my desk right now. So it's really hard, and my desk is extremely crammed. Um, I have one of those where it's like it's like a bunk bed, so the, the bed, my bed is on top of me, and then I have a little desk. So it's, it's pretty cool. Um... So, yeah, in the video right now, I'm just outlining the stuff. Um, when it, a lot of the parts I skip over is the part where I color them in so and add a lot of detail. Um, so I kind of just skipped ahead there um, because, like, I didn't think it really mattered me showing color. And it just took up, like, a lot of runtime because it just... I, I had to make this video short. Nobody's going to watch it for, like an hour, two hours, like, 25 minutes is still, like, I wish I could have cut this to shorter than 25 minutes, that, to me, I don't, I, I, I tried, but I just felt like if I cut out anything else, it's just not going to look right when I show the finishing product, and surprisingly, actually, I was looking on YouTube, there are not a lot of videos like this, um, I was having trouble knowing what to use, so I'll link the pen I used, the, um, the pencil I used, I think that's kind of obvious, but I'll still do it just in case you guys don't know, like, um, the Sharpie markers, everything, um, so I was kind of going on this just by ear, because I didn't know, like, the YouTube symbol, the first one I did, I started it in Sharpie, just not knowing, this was all new to me, um, maybe later, in like, a year or something, I could do, like, another, like, do a different shoe, like, another shoe, and make it, like, really cool and stuff. Um, and see, like, how much I improved. But, like I said, I'm never gonna wear this shoe anywhere. Because then I'll just have anxiety the whole time. Like, not wanting to ruin it. Being like, oh, I spent so much time on this. Uh, that's another thing about YouTube, though. It's like, it's always gonna be on here. Okay, and this is what I was talking about. That's a little egg wearing pants. Um, outlining him right now, if you can see that. I just sketched him one day. I, was, I think I was on a Boy Scout camp out. And I just sketched him. And I liked it. So, uh, he's just a little uh, screaming egg wearing pants. Uh, well, I think when I originally sketched him, he was floating in space. That was it, yeah. So, now I'm outlining the comics. So, after I get kind of the outline in the front, I mostly skip over the rest of it just because I really put a lot of time into the back um, and stuff. But, like I said, this turned out way better than I expected, which I was surprised because, like, I remember, like, when I first, like, touched the shoe with marker, I got so nervous, like, there was no going back. Okay, so I just finished that shoe, doing the outline, so now I'm going to start with this one. Um, so I'm starting with the Spider-Man. This one has a lot more Marvel stuff in it. Um, I can't say I have, like, a favorite one, like, which, which shoe is my favorite. Uh, because, like, both of them are so awesome and have different, different things that just I love. So... And I actually, I got in trouble when I was originally, when I was originally, originally sketching out ideas, what to put on there. I was doing it during science class and the teacher got mad at me. Um, so, yeah. And, um, yeah, that happened. So, like I said, the camera falls a lot, so I had to adjust it and stuff. Uh, I was going to ask one of my parents to, like, record it or something, or one of my friends, but then I was just like, this is going to take forever, and my friend, it's not like he's going to be able to come over every day after school. It's not like, it, both my parents are working, so it's like they can't record for, like, three hours while I do this. My dad did help recording some of it, some of the finishing, uh, where I'm, like, showing it, showing you guys the finished product, but, um... They, they weren't really able to help with this. It's just like, also, because my desk is so crammed, it's like hard. It'd probably be even harder with somebody recording. Um, but it worked. I mean, I was just, I just had to adjust the screen every once in a while. Um, I mean, 
sure it would have been nice if I were to have somebody holding it. Also, oh, you can even see the original sketches in the background if you look um, in the corner. So, yeah, you can see the original sketches I have. Um, so, also, what I loved is I have this um, one really small camera that I got for uh, Christmas. Yeah, it was for Christmas. Um, I got this uh, really small camera that has super wide view, um, which I love. I'm going to do some more recording with that um, because this camera is just amazing. So, I'm going to do more recordings with that camera, but yeah, it was able to literally capture everything just sitting on a bunch of books. So, I just stacked up books. I think in some shots, you're able to kind of see some corner of the books. Uh, I think I might have edited all those out. I really don't know. Um, for this video, I kind of, I made this differently than most videos. See, most videos, I record the audio, and then I, I, um, animate it based on the audio. Um... But with this, I I, cause I can't talk and draw because then, like, I'll, like, mess up in my drawing or I'll, like, mess up when I'm talking and just be, like, blah, 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 be, like, not really. I, I really just have to concentrate, like, be in the zen when I'm drawing because um, I just really had to focus. In some parts, I would talk, but I just cut those out because, like, because, um, like, right here, I think I talked. Um at this point, but I cut that out, so I'm talking over it, now, um, I think this is, I'm gonna have to, um, skip ahead, just because when I color it in and stuff, it's just gonna take forever, so you guys can get kind of a glimpse at, like, what I just did, and I am going to skip ahead and show you, like, it all colored in and stuff, because I still have to do the, um, the back and the sides, so I'm just gonna skip ahead right now, okay, guys, so bye, there we go, so, this is me after I've added in the rest of the details. Honestly, it looks pretty epic. Um, so, um, now I, I just have to do the sides and add a few more details, and then I'll be good to go. So, um, oh, also what I was going to do is I was going to uh, draw the um, all my favorite movies. I was going to write them on the um, rim, like my favorite movies and TV shows. So, one of them, I would do my favorite movies. And on the other, I would do my favorite TV shows just because, like, I can look back and see, like, oh, those were my favorite movies. Those were my favorite TV shows at the time. So here we go. I'm going to just go over it and pin. And just kind of write my favorite movies and TV shows. Um, and this I did actually record. So um, first, um, starting with TV shows, I got Stranger Things because I love Stranger Things. Stranger Things is awesome. Uh, we got Family Ties as well. Uh, it's got Michael J. Fox. It's a really good show. I would recommend it. Um, and then we also got Marvel's Runaways, that's another show that I really like, uh, it's not one of my, like, favorites, but, um, it, it's an okay show that I'll watch, I mean, I don't really have a bunch of, like, actual favorite shows that I really, like, love, love, they're just a couple, um, another one is Cobra Kai, it's a YouTube Red series, probably the only YouTube Red series, and I'm gonna be totally honest with you guys, Every time a new season comes out, I'll just go to a different Gmail account and renew the uh, monthly subscription and just binge the whole season and then cancel my subscription, my free trial. So I have never had to pay for a single season of Cobra Kai. So that's just a little secret. I know I probably shouldn't do that because it's probably YouTube is like, yeah, I don't know. I, I guess it's fine-ish. So now I'm starting on the next shoe with my favorite movies. So, um, we got the Avenger, Avengers Infinity War, of course, and actually, so here's the sad part, when I recorded this, I had not seen Endgame yet, this was before Endgame was out, so Endgame would definitely be on there, it was awesome, no spoilers, guys, don't, don't run, um, we also got Big on there, I don't know if you saw that, um, Ready Player One, I mean, it's not, one of my, the movie was okay, but the book was awesome, and then we got Spider, uh, I just wrote Spider-Verse, Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse, that movie was awesome, I think I've seen it four times, so now it's just like, meh, but it was amazing, so now I'm gonna write, okay, I'm gonna have to explain, now, I know you can't really see, that's because I just had it on some books, but I'm writing B-T-T-F, okay, guys, I'm gonna give you about 10 seconds to go into the comment section and try and guess what B-T-T-F stands for. Okay, have you guessed? Okay, I'm going to tell you. BTTF stands for Back to the Future. 
So I don't know if any of you guys got that right. So, because Back to the Future is, like, one of my all-time favorite movies. Um, actually, I like two better than one. Some people said three was the best. I don't, three was the worst. It was okay. But, so, yeah, I had to skip ahead because, like, I put a lot of detail into this. Um, you can see I kind of, like, put the orange and yellow just to kind of make it, give it that. And so, I also wrote Stranger Things. I didn't record that because it was really hard. Um, because Stranger Things is written in the Stephen King style. So, I really had to, like, put a lot of effort into that. And I also had to look up a picture of it. So, now I still have, um, two, three more sides, actually. Three more sides to write on. Um, uh, I may skip ahead part of it, but I'm tr gonna try and record some of it. And then the rest of it is just gonna be, like, um, me putting in detail, but I'm skipping ahead of most of that. So, for right here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna write the number six because, um... Uh, first off, I was born on the 6th, um, and I actually, so, here's a pretty funny thing, actually, 6 was my lucky number in hockey, and so it just kind of stuck, I was like, yep, 6 is my lucky number, and then, um, so then, all of a sudden, I realized, like, wait a minute, I was born on the 6th, so that was funny, and then my dad, so when, um, I was being born, my uh, parents got Chinese food, and he got a little fortune cookie, and on the fortune cookie on the back, I don't know if you guys have noticed, if you open up one of those fortune cookies on the back, it'll show lucky numbers, and six is one of the lucky numbers on the back of the fortune cookie. So six is like my hockey number and all that, so six is just like my lucky number, so I wanted to add that, because six is, it's awesome. So if you were to show, tell me she's a number between one and ten, I would choose six. So... <laughs> Um, now this one, I actually kind of started running out of ideas for what to put, so I just went with 80s. This one did not, sadly, this is probably my least favorite part of it, did not turn out how I wanted it to, just because I wanted to do a little cassette tape, but, um, because they're so detailed and I had to make it so small, it just kind of looked like a black square. Um, headphones turned out pretty good. It was good other than just that cassette tape that I just really don't like. So, as you can see, I just skipped ahead, and it's 80s cassette tape. I just really don't like that. It's just, uh, uh, I, I can't say I'm a fan. That was, yeah, it's, I'm not proud of it. I'm not really proud of that. I feel like I could have done better. kind of think I was rushing because this was, like, on the four, fifth day, I think. So, I was kind of just rushing to get this done with. Um, now this one, I actually, I was, I didn't know what to do, and I was like, Dad, what should I do? And he was like, what if you did, like, the Texas flag? Um, so I was like, okay, that's, okay. Um, so we got that going, so this was actually pretty cool, and a lot of people have said this is their favorite part about the shoe. A lot of people, as in my dad, and my mom, and my brother. Okay, my brother actually didn't say that. Uh, his favorite part, I think, was a Stranger Things, is what he said, because he also watches Stranger Things with me. And he really loves it. In fact, um, because we're not going to be able to watch it 4th of July, we're going on vacation. We're picking, like, an entire day just to binge it when we get home. Um, so, we got the uh, American flag. And I just, because I kind of did this pretty fast, I kind of just showed most of it. Um, also, like, I don't know if you guys seen those satisfying videos where it's, like, like, I feel like this is pretty satisfying. Just me, like, drawing and it's, like, speed. I feel like that's satisfying. I don't know. Let me know if that, that's satisfying to you guys. Because that feels... i just looking at that. That's satisfying. It just looks like... I don't know. There's just something about it. Like, just when you speed it up, it's just like... I don't know. Yeah. It's just weird. But I like it. I thought it was cool. Um, so I kept it. And I like... Like, all the colors are kind of different on the shoe. So, they're just not all, like, one, like, they're not all blue or all red. They're just all, it's all, it's all colorful, which I really liked. Um, and I was going to do, um, around the, um, the sole of the shoe, which is, like, the bottom of it. I was going to do something, but I was just, like, it's just going to get muddy and stuff, so, whatever. So, there you go. That is basically the finished product like, that is it. I know I added in some more details that I didn't show, so you can see I kind of outlined it. But that is the finished product. We got all the markers right there. And I am really proud of these. Now, I'm going to do a little um, thing where I, like, show you guys, like, how they look. Give you, like, a, three, a 180, 360 view or one, 180. I get the two confused. I'm going to say 180 view. 